In this video, I'm going to discuss um, set builder notation. So set builder notation um, is uh, a formal notation we can use to build up sets um, using uh, functions and other mathematical expressions. So this is uh, an example of the general form of set and builder no notation. We have on the left is the descriptions of the elements in the set, and on this, uh, the, the I guess the part on the right um, is the description of the the function that describe what's going that describes what's going on, and this vertical bar in the center is a, a I guess notation that means such that. So the way we read this is that x a variable is an element of a set s such that this function p of x is true or that x satisfies this function. So let's look at um, an example um, set. So let's say we have the set um, x an element of the integers um, such that x is less than 4 and x is greater than 1. So obviously our function is shown here on the right, and then the elements that we describe is shown on the left here. So we could rewrite this set, or write out the set, uh, all the, the individual elements of the set, by analyzing when this is true. So we know that we're talking about elements of our set only being integers, um, and we know that the elements belong to the set if what is uh, our function on the right is true. So only for values of integers that are less than 4 and greater than 1. So to be an integer and greater than 1, this has to be 2 and 3. So our set then is just the set 2 and 3. This is obviously a small example, um, and set builder notation is useful to describe sets formally for, for typically much larger samples. So this is really just a description of how to use these um, yeah, these formalisms.